I am stopping in today with a super exciting video. I am so excited to share this new planner that is coming out tomorrow from Paper Tray Inc. Um, if you follow my blog, you know that I am sort of a planner nerd. I love planners and post-its and washi tape and all the stamps that go with planners. They are so much fun. And so I've had a really fun time working with Nicole to come up with several new fun um, elements that you can add into your planner. And then, of course, Nicole designed this gorgeous little planner. This kind of shows you how big it is um, compared to this ruler. The size is about 7 by about 5. So it is a nice size, fits in your purse, um, and it's, it's really handy um, to have on the go. So the planner has different covers, um, and you can pick the one that you want. This one is so cute with rosy posy, some stripes. This is um, probably my favorite one. And it is actually removable, and it just pops right into the coil. This is another one, cute little rainbow design. And then I've actually taken the third one, and I put it on the back here of my planner just for an extra laminated cover. And also if I want to switch it, then I've got it handy. So it's it's on the back here and it says the future depends on what you do today. So another cute, cute cover. The planner is divided up into months and it has these great colorful tabs on the outside so you can find right where you want to go. And it has an adorable rainbow theme throughout. So there's good paper tray ink colors. There is a calendar here in the front and then these are the dates to remember pages which is so fun to have because you can always look back at these and always transfer them over into your next year's planner. And then it just starts, oh, and here's this page. This is so cute. This year I will, and there's just a great space to just jot down notes, maybe some uh, New Year's resolutions or just things you want to do for the year. So a month is set up basically with a full month layout right when you open into this is January and then as you go from there you have weekly so it shows Sunday through Saturday you've got a place for notes over here and then notes on the bottom as well when you get to the end of that month it starts these daily pages and these are just so much fun you've got a place for notes and um, this is a good hydrate I use these now just to fill in, you know, kind of keep track of your water intake through the day. You've got tasks. Um, you can jot down what you've eaten. Um, active. I love this. How much, what you want to do for the day, your goal, and what you've achieved. And I think probably the most fun part of this is this spot right here. It says be grateful and then a memorable moment. Taking these with you and putting them in a, a scrapbook later at the end of the year, you've got these notes that you've jotted down every day, and this this might be my most favorite part. Just making this um, planner also a journal, and even could be a scrapbook. You could even just stick pictures on on these pages, and really just keep track of memories. So each month has a quote on the front, and then it, it's its own. Um, color combo and cute colors so that's how it goes throughout the rest of the planner I have a few pages here that I've started this is next week actually um, I sit on Sundays and I plan out the next week so I did that a little bit early but I've written everything down and some of the things that are included here I want to show you we have the, um, these are basic pages. Um, this is basically five dies that work. You can just pop right into the coil binding. So you can pretty much die cut anything you want to. I have actually here die cut some uh, monthly moments, a piece of cardstock, and then one of the quotes, and I stuck that right in. I'm technically using these as a dashboard. This little divider right here is actually one of these pages and I just cut it cut it down about to two inches and I stuck the top out so I could have a divider just like a bookmark to open from the top 
And then this small one, I thought this was a great idea. This could be used as kind of like a clip. You can make a something and then glue it to this and pop this in. So you could pop anything inside of your planner. So to show you some of the stamp sets that come, this first one I'm really excited about. I love lists. I make lots of lists, probably too many. Um, but I love sticky notes and I put them everywhere and this is actually called Posted. This stamp right here fits perfectly onto a post-it note. And you can see I've done right, one right here. It comes with circles, stars, squares, hearts, just different bullet points to add to your sticky note. And then there's a tomorrow and a today for the title. Of course you don't have to use that, but this just gives you a really nice organized post-it note. So um, this right here shows you just a list I have of things I need to get done. And I like to be able to check mark off what I have done and that way I can see what I have left to do. So super fun set right there. This next one is called Planner Banners. Um, I love to have little flags in my planners and so when I drew this stamp set up I just knew that there needed to be a way to cut out several banners at once and I showed this to Nicole and she came up with um, the design for this and then also the banner or the uh, die that goes with it. So when you stamp the banner, um, one solid stamp right here, this little uh, cross in the middle, you just line that up and I just stuck a little piece of washi tape and it cuts out each banner. So you can stamp a color, you can obviously do this on just plain cardstock if you want to, and then you have all these little words and uh, oil change, do today, meet at, lunch at, all these different things that you can make these banners here. And I have these little workout ones. I actually cut these out of cardstock and just stuck them down with some removable tape so I can uh, pull them out of my planner and move them around. And then I have a couple more over here. Um, and then I, these are actually on labels. So I, I cut these out of an adhesive sheet and they work too as removable stickers. Uh, the No School comes from the family banners. So this kind of has more of a kid theme, field trip, class party, no school. Um, really cute, just a family edition. And then there's also blog banners, which these are perfect for those of us who blog. And we have things due, posts go live, giveaway ends, photos due. And it really, really works uh, to help keep your blog organized. I've used a couple of those over here. My post goes live at 8, post goes live at 6, and um, these are again ad just a adhesive sheet so those will peel off and I can move them around if I need to. Another set that kind of goes along with the memory theme, this is called Remembered and she's um, given a little uh, Polaroid stamp frame and then another of the one, two, three, just places to write memories and things that you want to remember throughout the week. So another fun little stamp edition. So I think that's pretty much it. Um, I have lots more ideas and things that to share. Um, I do want to show you these, I guess. I stamped these on different adhesive sheets. This is my little tray of different colored banners. And then I have... Um, some other shapes from the Clip It's Monthly Moments set. I've put these here. I've just cut these out in white and that way I can color them with a Copic or stamp on them and add them to my planner later. And then these circles are actually from a um, cover plate. So these popped out. These are on adhesive labels and these will work well just to to put different color dots throughout the planner. So going back to the monthly moments uh, series, there is a ton of, of those stamp sets and dies that will work great in this planner and just make cute additions. Actually here is one little arrow I use for that. That's from the Clip It set. Anyways, um, I hope that you enjoy this and I will have lots more to share coming up soon and I can't wait to hear what you think. Thanks so much for stopping in. Thank you.